Friday after work. Uh, my wife's going to take care of the barn for me this weekend, and I'm headed turkey hunting finally. I'm going to meet my brother. He's up there waiting on me. We got permission to hunt some private property. First time in my life. He spotted 15 turkeys. He says there's one real good Tom and a couple Jakes, but they're on the other side of the fence, of course. So we're gonna go spend the night over there. Try to figure them out real quick. I've never been to this place, so it'll be interesting. Hopefully I can get some, some good footage. I'm gonna film him first. Hopefully we double. He says there's turkey feathers and scat just scattered everywhere. So it sounds like there's quite a few turkeys in there. We'll see what happens. Okay guys, I just got here. It's beautiful. Just seen a turkey run across the road up in front of us. But I pull up, my brother meets me down on the road and he freaking couldn't wait for me, I guess. Got him a little Jake. A little Jaker. Not a big boy, but. First turkey. First turkey. Can't beat that. How much do you think he weighs? 15, maybe 20. Yeah. Awesome. Couldn't wait for you. <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> that other turkey I seen it run up, ran up that hill on, you know, that scrub oak. So he said he got that one about a mile from here. <clears throat> but he heard one gobble here this morning, so we're gonna go go set up and see if I can use this box call at all. Alright guys, we just got to this cabin and it's very nice Look, inside. Feather in the water bowl. But what we we we're about, we just came to drop my car off and check this out. Turkey poop in the bed of the truck and a feather in this water bowl. So while we were out calling turkeys, I guess the turkey jumped in the damn truck. I think he put it there, but he swears he didn't. I swear I didn't put it there. <laughs> well, we're doing it all wrong, buddy. Why would I put a turkey feather in my gold pan? <laughs> I don't know. Why would I put turkey shit in the bed? Is it even fresh or is it just something stale? Nah, dude. Couldn't get any fresher than that. <laughs> I'll be damned. What the hell? Well, that is wild. We saw a group of five, looked like four Jakes and one pretty big Tom running down the road in front of us on our way up here. We're gonna go back down to the river bottom and see if we can't see something before dark. Jesus. I'm using those new whammy shells. They scatter less, but when you really want to blow a hole in something. All right, guys, we, I got one, my first turkey. We didn't get any pictures of it on the ground because it's pouring. Now we just, we're so we want to get back and get the heater. It's made fifth. Usually, you know, just, just Monday when I was shed hunting for the elk, it was freaking hot. I looked at my car, it's 40, 39 degrees. 39 degrees. Man, it's wet and it's cold. It is. But I'm super excited. Got, you don't have a real big beard, but we're trying to get back to the cabin before dark so we can get a picture together with our first birds. And I think we found a new honey hole. And the turkey honey <laughs> hole. Big shout out to Owen, by the way, for definitely. Us up. Thank you, sir. We, uh, I guess we're gonna go home now. No sense of burning his wood up. Right. And I get to sleep in tomorrow. <laughs> Maybe I should stay at my mom so Mel still has to do my chores. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll go home, but I'm that's it's awesome. We'll we'll turn you back on as soon as we get back to the cabin. <laughs> Alright guys, we got we both got our bird stayed. Our first turkey for both of us, and yeah. this place is loaded, huh? Lots, man. A lot of birds here. A lot of birds. And I can't make up the bird shit in the back of the truck. I still am not sure if he's <laughs> messing with me, but we came back to the cabin, and that was in there. It was an omen. So we all asked back down and what? called for, well, we sat in the rain for 40 minutes. 
It's raining now, and I'm, yeah. it's cold. It's cold. I'm off sunburned because it was 85 three days ago. Now yeah. it's 38. Look at my turkey's, turkey's tail fan. 39. It's quivering, and it's not because of the wind. It's because of me <laughs> shaking. <laughs> anyway, we're going to get the heck out of here before we can't get up these muddy roads to, yeah. to get out of here. we still got some things to do, and thanks for watching, guys. Oh, and don't forget to go check out Feather and Bone. That's his channel. Yeah. So I'll put a link in the description, and thanks for watching. All right, you. You got another one of them zip ties? Yes, I do. About 100 of them.